Well, hello. Uh, today, I've got an order in from Kraken Dice. Uh, this isn't a mystery box, although I did get a couple of mystery gifts in the box from this order I placed. But I, I wanted to, to, to share this because um, Kraken has some great products and some great minis uh, that, that are sort of worthy of showing off. So uh, I, I guess I'm just at this point doing free advertising for all these places that I'm so in love with. Uh, first, look at this great mimic box. Um, totally, totally not a mimic. Um, uh, every box that they send is just really cool. So great job, Kraken. Um, <clears throat> let's get into it real quick. Uh, I'm going to set my invoice here to the side because it doesn't matter. I don't want anybody to know how much I spend on this stuff. Um, another mimic uh, sticker set. I love my favorite one, not a mimic. <laughs> Uh, but really, really cool. Um, I did request a dice bag with a set of dice I ordered. Uh, I, I did go with the small. What's the small dice bag that they sent out? It's very cute. Uh, this is a Valor patch for my gaming bag. Uh, so, yeah, it's that's too great not to throw on my new gaming bag, uh, which I talked about on my blog. Uh, if you don't read my blog, it's davidsboringblog.com. Uh, here is the set of mystery dice I'll open in a minute. Uh, that wasn't the set I ordered. This was actually a gift for the dumb amount of money I spent. Um, this is the set of dice I ordered. I actually ordered silicon for the first time. Uh, I've not, I've not got silicon dice previously uh, because to me it's like, are they rubber and bouncy uh, or 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 whatnot? Um, there we go. Um, but this is this is my first time uh, taking a fill of them, and they are they are they are silicone or rubber dice, which is is kind of neat. I plan to ink these. I don't know if I'm going to go with a gold or a silver. Um, I got to see. I got how bouncy. Okay, they're bouncy as can be, and that's pretty okay. Uh, obviously, on my little wooden table here, they 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 bounce a bit extra. Um, but that's, that's really cool. That's a, a squishy, bendy silicon set of dice. How great are those colors? I mean, that's just too cool. Um, love them. Put the dice over here out of the way. Uh, got my nice little free keychain. Uh, got to admit that may go on the motorcycle keychain. Um, and, uh, this was a free... A free gift with my order. I don't even need to cut the seals on it. Um, just because they have an amazing spring cleaning cell going on right now. Uh, I don't know how well the camera captures how glittery and liquid the inside of that is. But absolutely beautiful uh, D20. That uh, I think those are like 35 millimeter, but I may be wrong. So Beautiful. Nice addition to the collection. And part of the reason that I keep placing cracking orders and making sure I get over, over $20 is the cute little mini line that they have. Um, so this is a Displacer Beast Kitten. And there was no way I was missing out on a Displacer Beast Kitten. I mean, how cute, how innovative. I'm a cat guy, so... Uh, love, love the idea of D Displacer Beast Kitten. I can't wait to write this into one of my sessions. Like, that's, that's too cool. Uh, but I went with a whole series of things here on minis, which I haven't done a big minis order. Uh, hey, Kraken, I really want a subscription box where I can get, you know, my monthly mini and, um, uh, and a set of dice and maybe a dice bag every month. I uh, sign me up like ridiculous. So that's a skeleton spearman. Uh, I've get recently got back into painting minis, uh, which there may be some mini painting videos coming. I don't know. I'm not, I don't know if I'm that brave, but because I'm terrible at it. But uh, skeletal spearman. Uh, I always feel like I need more undead in my minis collection. Uh, so there's there's the skeleton spearman. Uh, skeleton with a sword. I started to get a couple of him and just decided to go one each. 
uh, kind of cool. Uh, here is the skeleton leader, which is just, I mean, he's, he looks like he's just amazing. Um, also a little bit of like to be or not to be action there. Like how fantastic is he? So go get them boys. Right. Um, my favorite by far the skeleton with the two axes, they call them hatchets, hatchet works, um, of the skeletons. I like the leader, but I also really like, uh, Mr. Double axes here. He's pretty great. Still love that Displacer Beast Kitten. And then I think this is my last skeleton here. Um, yep, Archer. Reaching, reaching for an arrow, Archer. Um, honestly, it made me want to play Diablo 2 almost immediately. Um, but uh, Skeletal Archer, totally a thing. So I got my nice little skeletal war band it looks like a, a an undead adventuring party which is fantastic uh the other the other line and i've already got a couple of their goblins whoops sorry i'm bumping the tripod or monopod um this is the goblin hoarder um and he is literally doing that he's he's hoarding everything so um, my favorite Reaper mini is a, a character that they call Ogden the Unbur the Overburdened. And uh, this little guy is the goblin equivalent of being overburdened. He, he, he wants all the stuff. And he's going to set you on fire, which is, is super cool. So there's, there's my first gobby. Um, this, frankly, I think is one of the most rare and awesome minis. Um, Check out the, I love the way they do their box art. It, it shows it from different angles. I mean, like lesson to all mini makers. There you go. It's done right. Um, female goblin. She has goblin boobies, guys. And goblin booty. How great is gob are goblin boobies? That's, uh, yeah, that should be the tagline of this video. How great are goblin boobies? So there's uh, your female goblin. Uh, let's see. Try to save the my favorites for last. Um, I'm 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 very. It's very important to me have to have a variety of gender in my uh, minis. And I'll be honest, when I play things like Skyrim, I always play female um, because I'd rather look at a female for 40 hours or plus. Uh, but some of these uh, female minis are just gorgeous. Talk about something I'd really enjoy painting. She just. She looks like a barmaid about to stab somebody in the face or a pirate. I think she's called shark bait. So, uh, I, I couldn't leave her there at the sale they're having right now. Um, and this is like one of my favorite things in, in life. I want one of these plague masks for real. Uh, but here's your, here's your plague doctor type character. Um, and uh, you got to appreciate holding the lantern. I don't know what weapon that is. Is that just a staff or is that like a uh, actual axe head type of thing? It doesn't matter. Make up what you want. But gorgeous mini. Couldn't leave him behind. Uh, and then my absolute favorite uh, when, I was, when I was going through him, short of sort of my displacer base kitten, is... Uh, female druid here um i mean just a gorgeous mini uh with the stag horns not trying to show off the decolletage there but whatever you know i guess sometimes being in a sword and sorcery can be in the boobs too it's okay it's okay no judgment but yeah i placed a a small uh small minis order and uh now we'll we'll jump into the theme of the thing I always do and check out the my bonus pack of mystery dice here. And uh, it's pretty pretty fun, pretty exciting. Dun, 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 dun. Oh wow. That is that is I don't know. It's either really pretty or really, really ugly. Uh nice glittery 
grayish, purplish. I don't know, man. I'm either going to love those or, or hate those. Um, but it's a set of dice market uh, mystery dice. So I will say this for them. Whether you love them or hate them, you have to admit that they're pretty darn unique. So um, I like unique dice too. So yeah, so that was... That was all the swag out of my out of my order, and uh, uh, really looking forward to inking in the numbers on my silicone dice. And uh, I own my first set of silicone dice. So anyway, thanks for watching. Tell your friends.